Hi friends, welcome back. Today I'll be sharing how I have prepared uh, green peas, fresh green peas for freezing and an instant uh, breakfast recipe, green peas idli. It's so soft and delicious and also a simple chutney made with coconut and to make the idlis we'll first take one cup of fresh green peas and into this we'll add some coriander leaves, two chilies and a small piece of ginger. Now we'll grind this coarsely. Take it into a bowl and into this we'll add one cup of curd and one cup of regular suji or rava. Mix it well. The mix should not be very uh, thick or very loose. Just add enough water to uh, bring it to this consistency. And now we'll keep this aside to rest for about 15 minutes. Meanwhile, for a tempering, we'll uh, take one teaspoon of oil into that mustard seeds, one teaspoon of urad dal, and one teaspoon of chana dal. Add salt into the batter, mix it well. If you feel that water is required, just add a little water to adjust the consistency. Add some curry leaves and we'll pour this into the batter. Just mix it and finally we'll add half teaspoon of baking soda and a teaspoon of water to mix the baking soda and we'll just mix it in uh, into the batter and now the batter is ready to make idlis. Here I've taken the uh, idli stand and I've greased it. Now we'll pour the idli batter into the idli stand now we we'll Keep it in the vessel with the boiling water and now we'll steam this for 10 minutes. Meanwhile we'll make the chutney. Here I've taken coconut uh, grated and into that two cloves of garlic, some pudina leaves and one green chilli and some fried gram. Salt to taste. Add some water and we'll grind this into a paste. Now for the tempering I have taken oil, mustard seeds and some curry leaves and the chilli and red chilli. And a delicious chutney is also ready. The idlis are nicely steamed. Yeah, so it is ready. So we'll take it. Uh, we'll uh, switch off the flame and allow it to cool down a little. We should remove the idli from the uh, idli plate only after it is cooled down, so that it will be perfect. Otherwise, it might stick to the spoon and to the plate. So this is how it will be. 
nice and soft a very delicious breakfast please do try the recipe Now I have this uh, fresh green peas, so I thought of uh, freezing it. So I'll just I'm just uh, peeling the green peas. It was nearly uh, one and three fourth kg. By the time I peeled it, it was uh, late, so I just kept it in the fridge. And next day morning, I uh, started the procedure for freezing it. Here I have kept water to boil into this 1 teaspoon of salt and 1 teaspoon of sugar I have added. Into the boiling uh, water I have uh, added washed green peas. Now I will look at the clock and allow it to uh, be in this water for just 2 minutes. After 2 minutes we will drain it. Immediately we will transfer this uh, green peas into ice cold water. This is to arrest the cooking of the uh, green peas any further. And now we will allow the green peas to be in cold water till it becomes nice and cold. Once it is well cooled down, we will transfer this into a strainer. Green peas uh, once processed like this and stored will stay good for almost a year. Now we will pack this in uh, Ziploc bags. Now we will remove the air and uh, seal it properly. Now it's ready to go into the freezer and it will stay good for almost a year. Thank you for watching. Bye.